Sorry about your spin. Uh, okay, you know what? I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're just dead, kiddo. I don't know why he spun into me. But what's the point? I lost the cannon! Can you really call it a wicked trick if you lose the cannon? Oh my god. My CSing is sloppy. Alright, Albert, get back into the groove of things. Okay, now, what is, what is cooler than being cool? Lethality Ribbon, you guessed it right. We ain't doing none of that pussy shit. We ain't doing that Gore Drinker Ribbon where you just like infinitely sustain. We've done that a million times on our regular account. I'm pretty sure I win this. Uh, let me just wait it out. Wait out my cooldowns. Woohoo! You thought you were the only one who could go over walls. That wall hop was planned from like a, m a mile ahead. It was so obvious from the beginning. And the reason we know this is because we are wicked today. We knew it was going to come down to that because we are wicked and we have the wicked ability to calculate. Yeah, playing AD carry solo is like kind of lame because you're just like playing with someone you can't really communicate with. I think it's just the elo that I'm in. Oh, I, I don't. I, yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't expect these people to care much about the ADC role. I think they play support as like a carry role. I mean, if someone starts the game by saying their own name and then will be nine, it's like, oh. <laughs> okay. Wicked. Uh, that was Kindred Flush, right? <gasps> I missed the plate! <laughs> we won, but at what cost? Oh god, what a rookie mistake to miss the plate. Okay, so Trinimir is fun, because it's all about kiting him. So I take Nimbus Cloak to make sure I have, like, ultimate kiting ability. Because it's all about, like, surviving his lethal tempo. I need to wait until his ult is, or my ult is up. Does anyone else find killing the scuttle like really sad? You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? It's like you're beating a helpless guy and he's just running away like, don't kill me. And literally everyone wants to kill him. So much that like literally like people on two, two different teams will gang up to kill him. Hey, he doesn't fight back. It's quite sad. Oh crap, I could have kept fighting that. Mm, this is a little counterproductive. I'm gonna roam. I'm like shooting myself in the foot by, by delaying my uh, my item. But I'm pretty sure I can get a double kill here really quick. Oh yeah, 100% a double kill. Oh my god, it's literally so free. Uh, I think the scent is like... A flash. Nice, dude. Uh, I, I could have survived that, I think. I think I need to play that slower. Yeah, no need no need for me to rush in like that. I could have waited. That's not bad. That's okay. Not the end of the world. If I use my flash to get a double kill later, it's all worth it. Okay, you might be thinking, box, box, this sucks. Your teammates are dragging you down. No. This is actually a greedy YouTuber's wet dream. Look at it. My teammates suck cock. I have everything to myself. The enemy team won't surrender because they have a chance of winning. I will farm montage clips for days! Bye bye. Alright, I, I can get like two plates here. Actually, honestly, more. Because Trinimere used Flash. I'm pretty sure his heal's coming out, but he has no ult now. Which means I can kill him. Okay. So, according to my calculations, Trinimere will be here in about three seconds. So, let me go up and meet him in front of the turret. Oh, buddy. You got too greedy for the farm. Now I get the whole turret. Okay, you see these stacks up here? Make sure to wait for that to expire before you take the plate. This way you can take the full turret. And it's expired. Poor Trinomere. I have zero sympathy for Trinomere players. Trinomere players are obnoxious. They're like Shaco players. Trinomere players are like some of the biggest assholes I've ever seen. 
except for the top Tryndamere players. It's actually very interesting. The best Tryndamere's I've ever faced are also some of the nicest people I've ever seen. Isn't that weird? Yeah, at the top of the ladder, like I face challenger Tryndamere players who I hate facing. Like they are so obnoxiously frustrating with their gameplay, but they are, they are some of the nicest guys out there. Uh, I'll tell you who's an asshole like all the way through around Shaco players. I feel like I've seen so many toxic Shaco players. Mm, I'm like 80% sure I can kill here. Ignite or ult? How about neither? Are you serious? The confidence on that man! I want whatever he's having. I kill it. All right, I practice this. I practice this. Uh, there's an Ash coming like Super far away. She my ulti. It's gonna be like, yeah. Eh, eh. Sorry, man. I couldn't follow. That's okay. Yeah, too scary. Oh, uh, what do I want to get now? I want to do like super burst. Yeah, give me that ghost blade. Okay. So now, how do you win this game? Your fed is riven. What do you do? Your teammates are very far behind. You cannot just stay in your lane. If I just come here and kill Trinimer every time I can, we're not gonna win. We need to capitalize on the fact that Riven is really, really broken when she's ahead. So I need to use this time to just like go on a rampage. Roam everywhere and just kill everyone. Don't rely on my teammates at all. What's up, Kindred? Conqueror! Dude, no way. Oh, no. What? <laughs> oh! That was sick. That one minion. Yeah, yeah it's a free dragon. Sure. I'm a coming! I'm a coming! I got that red buff slow on you. Uh, oh, let's try. Oh, come on. Sidestep! No, it wasn't enough. Oh, man. Uh, maybe I can just sneak around? Oh my god, was that a crit? Got it. Check us out. <laughs> See ya! Before you can ult. That's my favorite thing to do against Trinimir. You do some sort of wicked animation cancel, give him no chance to react. You know, there's some point where the Trinimir player is like, okay, I should get ready to ult. And you know at that health bar, he was not thinking about it. Because we made our ult animation come out of nowhere, like out of thin air. It's so satisfying, using that ult animation to cancel everything, to hide it. That's a very specific animation cancel too. Uh, doing third Q and R at the same time. It's one that has like very little practicality, except for creating confusion. What's up? I can make her ult. Okay, you can also just not ult, that's fine. Uh, I have my wind slash coming up. Uh, okay, this one's just pure style points. Hey, okay, Jenna. Jenna. Oh, oh my goodness. Wicked. That was actually probably the most nuts thing I've done in a week. Oh shit, you're 17 and three, dude. Dude, look at my score. 
<laughs> Let's go. Look at my score, dude. I'm fucking 0 and 2. <laughs> 80 carry line. I've got zero kill participants. I've, I've never touched a kill. I've played uh, Caitlyn to Masters, and almost every single game was like, good job, Box Box. You didn't feed your ass off. You sat there and went 0 3 0 in the laning phase, and then you gave extra damage in team fights without dying. Great job, and you let her mid lane carry. Yep. That's, uh, that's what I'm doing here. Why is that? Okay, well, I still have my wind slash. Sets up this arrow. Oh, that is just so ham. Let's get out of here. Oh yeah! Oh yeah. Oh yeah! Okay, I want some extreme sports now. I want to see how long we can hang in there with, with no health. Actually, I kind of want to recall right here. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's go. I can ulti. Oh yeah. I mean, I have nothing up, but yeah. I'm feeling it. Sure, let's go. I got him. Okay. Ah, uh, I should have racked up Kraken Slayer first. Oh, I'm, I'm. Oh, I screwed up. Wait, never mind. I got him. I can fire a. Sh oh. Yep. Thanks, Eric. You can fire a what? Shot. I was, I was gonna like. Just get rid of that. Listen, thirty ass goes. Wait, Lethality Riven is so much fun. All you have to do is be in 20 and 3 before it, it like pops off. But once you get to that point, it's pretty satisfying. Okay, one more for the montage. Is it good? Uh, on second thought, let's not put that one in the montage. I got minion blocked for 6 seconds and died. Holy shit, I'm killing something. Let's go, dude. I killed him. Wait, that's not fair. I, I got straight up creep blocked. Existence is pain. Yeah, they're fat. Fat as hell, dude. That's why I like the old PD. That didn't make you go through that. I'm coming! I'm coming, Pepe W! Okay, okay. Wait! I have to collect the seven Dragon Balls first. One sec. What, what, what are the Dragon Balls? Uh, the red and blue buffs. Oh. oh! I think if I'm gonna play ADC, I'm gonna play Ash, dude. That way I can fire my ultis and feel like I'm useful. I feel like you just don't want to play AD carry in general unless you're duo with a support. Let's take a look, what is this clip? I can make her ult. Okay, you can also just not ult, that's fine. Uh, I have my wind slash coming up. Uh, okay, this one's just pure style points. Hey, I'll Jenna. Jenna. Oh, oh my goodness. Wicked. Wait, it's one that has like very little. Did I hit him with the wind slash there? Uh, okay, this did I actually hit the trinity with that? This one's just oh my pure god, style points. If so, that is actually pure style points. Let's slow motion it. Did I actually hit him? Oh! Okay, that's actually like the nuttiest play we've done in a while. Please hold my 